Do you know how the creature controls its slaves? The will subversion manifests as intense pain if directives are ignored. Uh -oh. The effect is severe enough that subjects are soon conditioned against even minor thoughts of rebellion. Observation suggests the Thorian views its thralls in a utilitarian way. Care is apparently taken to avoid injuring them, much as a craftsman avoids damaging his tools. As long as no action is taken against the creature's objectives, the subjects are free to pantomime a normal existence until specifically tasked with something. Oh boy. Oh, that's interesting. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And welcome back to Mass Effect, the original. This is Hill, and we are here on the planet Pharos. And we are about to embark on a journey to Exogeny headquarters. For that, we're going to need the Mako. And we're going to have a lot of obstacles up ahead. Dropship. Oh boy. And I guess we have. I don't know what those are. Are they Colossus or Armatures? Whatever they are. We are receiving a weak console. I cannot pinpoint its location through the Geth. up ahead. I'm sorry, we are not approaching this in a very tactical manner. Forward shields are already depleted. Okay, what have we got inside here? Do have an enemy detected? Alright, we don't see anything yet. Barrier up. Liara, you should do the same. Bring it on. Oh, bring it on. I like that. Alright, we're gonna go. I'm just gonna throw. down. That's the last of them. All right, I think there's yes, there's a technician kit here. Rail extension and medical interface 7. Oh, and there's something else, a locked crate. Here we go with my poor hacking skills here. Alright, uh, Banshee 8 Assault Rifle, and a Sniper Rifle Punisher 7, and a Biotic Amp Prodigy 7. It'd be nice if that might be better than what we've got, I don't know. We'll check that out later. All 
Alright, let's see if we can do a save here. Yes. Okay, Tally. But let's see what's going on down here. That's close enough! Relax, Jong. They're obviously not Geth. Get back, Juliana. Who are you? What do you want? I suggest you put that weapon down unless you're ready to use it. Hmm. Don't worry about him. He only cares about the company. And you trust too easily, Juliana. I'm just glad to see a friendly face. I thought we were the only humans left on this planet. By Dan and some of the members of Zoo's Hope are still alive. I thought you said they were all dead. I said they were probably all dead. They're surviving despite everything the Geth have done to them. We know what that's like. Those damn synthetics are relentless. Just tell me where I can find them. <laughs> you see? They're not here to save us. We should just wait for company support before we... Ignore him. The Geth are up in the Exogeny headquarters, just a bit further along the Skyway. Those headquarters are private property, soldier. Remove the Geth and nothing else. Mm. I'm not interested in your company's secrets. Commander, before you go, my daughter, Lisbeth, she's missing. They shouldn't waste time poking around. We can do a proper accounting of our casualties after the Geth are gone. That's my daughter you're talking about. She's still alive. I know it. Wow, this guy. Tell me about the colony. We established ourselves here four years ago. Growth was steady until the attacks. Our biggest challenge has been the lack of resources. There's just so little here of value. Still, we were making a go of it. It was even starting to feel like home. What brought you here? I guess I thought this would be the start of a new life. I wanted to go where I could feel like I was making a difference. Instead, everything we built is destroyed. It's very hard not to lose hope. Do you know what the Geth are after? I have no idea. We certainly haven't found anything of use. Something Exogeny is keen to remind us of. We need to recoup our expenses. It's nothing personal. Where is your daughter, Juliana? She was working in the Exogeny building when the attacks came. Oh, yeah, there were several places she could hide. For a short time. If she's in there, I'll get her out. Thank you, Commander. Thank you. How did you get split up from the Zeus Hope colony? Most of us live closer to the Exogeny building. Zeus Hope was mostly used as a port. When the Geth hit, we scattered. Until you told us about the others, we assumed they were killed in the first wave. If we had known they were still alive, we might have attempted to join them. They're fairly secure now. Maybe you should do that. No, 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 no. I don't think that's a good idea. We, we have no vehicles, and the Skyway offers little protection. Like the building we're in now? Listen, hmm. our best hope is to sit tight and wait for company reinforcements. They'll come eventually. What was the building used for? Oh, yeah, we repurposed that structure to serve as headquarters for Exogeny. That's mostly offices with a number of uh, light-duty R&D labs. Exogeny is a master at repurposing anything and everything. The company has to make a profit somehow, Juliana. Ferros is a long way from self-sufficient. Stay bunkered down until I find out what the Geth are after. Of course. And okay. please remember, if you see my daughter, Yes, I'll remember. All right, there is one other individual here that has a quest for us. Let's see if we can find him. I think it's this guy over here. I was hoping you'd have a moment to speak with me. I've got a bit of a problem. Everybody wants something. Hurry up about it. Hmm. Fair enough. I need to retrieve some data. It's not a big job, but it pays well. I'm listening. Good. Good. 
poking around in the ruins has become a bit too dangerous for me. What is it about you that makes people assume we enjoy being in harm's way? It's not that bad, really. All you need to do is find my console at Exogeny headquarters and drop the data onto this OSD. It's that simple. You're awfully quick to trust me with this. Have you seen anyone else heading to Exogeny lately? Hmm. I'll look around if I get the chance. I appreciate it. That data could be worth a lot of money. Of course, this all depends on getting out of here alive. Tell me about the data I'm getting for you. Plans for a few prototype mods? I'm a freelancer. Some of my mods are highly sought after. Why work in the middle of nowhere if your skills are so useful? Maybe I've got a bit of the frontier spirit in me. That, and the alternative is a bit too secure for my liking. Freelancers don't have to worry about security as much, so long as we keep a low profile. Do you have any idea what the Geth were looking for? Uh... That's for smarter men than me to figure out. I have no idea what anyone would want with this ruin. Time to get moving. Just keep in mind what I said. Okay, so it's important to get these quests so that you don't have to backtrack. Or I think if you actually come back here, um, it's too late to get that uh, particular assignment. And, of course, we want all the experience we can get as we are going through a 60-point one-time playthrough. Okay, let's continue on. Okay, we've already got enemies on the radar. Oh, boy. I saw the name of it this time. I think that's what we're dealing with, is just armatures. You owe us for this. The Skyway is crawling with Geth. Package is secure. We're leaving now. All right. Sounds like someone's in here. Geth. All right, Tally, I'll take some sabotage. And Liara, overload. I tell you, severed. these two are just too much with these powers. Okay, we've got a med kit. Upgrade kit, sledgehammer rounds, and snowblind rounds. Is that it? thinking I could get down here in this tunnel. I guess not. Okay, so let's keep moving. Probably need another save. And off we go. Alright, yeah, that was the other exit from that Location. Wait, Wait, what's this? Shut down the calm. We've got incoming Geth. Damn it! Nope. Shut down the calm. All right, here's an area. En route. All right, weapons ready. Uh oh, there's a dead body here, or what the game likes to refer to as a corpse. It's not, I don't think it's actually behind this curtain. Yes, it is. All 
All right, Liara, it's time for some barriers. I'm gonna see if I can't get a singularity back there. And I would like from my squad, double overload. Got them. That's the last of them. And another corpse. Okay, what have we got here? A Stinger 8 pistol and a Striker 8 sniper rifle. Okay, let's keep going. I think we've finally gotten to that point where I'm powerful enough to take on most of these enemies with relative ease. So hopefully no more death scenes. Critical mission failures. Uh-oh, here we go. How's okay, our shields are back. Oh my goodness. Not doing too bad. I mean, no critical damage to the make go. Uh-oh, we've got more jamming. And look at this out here. I never noticed this before. Off to the left, there's the, uh, the Geth ship attached to this building. Still trying to use my technique of using the Mako for kills because of the experience boost that I get. But I think we've, uh, they're gonna avoid us from here. Ah, okay. Tally and Liara. Double overload. Alright, we've still got another enemy up here. And for that, I'm going to call on a barrier. Let's go. Oh, he's a rocket trooper. Let's see. Tally, if you would sabotage him so that perhaps he couldn't use his rocket. And Liara, it's time for lift. He's down. Or up, as the case may be. Alright, we're still getting jammed, so there's something else in the area. Alright, stay on guard, people. Stay on guard. Alright, we've got a barrier curtain here. I don't know if it's Prothean, it probably is. Our weapons cannot touch a field like this. We'll need another way in. Liara, is this another Prothean barrier curtain? Okay, you don't have to tell me. All right, we need another way in. I think there's a door down here that we need to enter. All right, easy decryption. All right, we 
probably should do a save here. Alright, guns at the ready, people. We've got Let's a take them out. malfunctioning object. And we have a geth that's just waiting to come alive. I guess we have to get this uh, object first. Alright, so we have Energized Plating 8, Kinetic Exoskeleton 8, Sledgehammer Rounds 8. Alright, it's coming alive. Alright, I'm going to use Singularity. Liara. Now let's... How about Lift to keep it off guard? And can you sabotage that tally? Wait, what's going on? A gun isn't firing. All right, let me put up a barrier. Liara, you better put up one too. No. Oh! Sorry, Tally. We had to run out of here. Okay, we got it. Think we got him, Commander. Barely. That was kind of awkward, but hey, let's go. <laughs> I guess I should have told you guys to stay back in this um, hallway. All right, let's continue. Let's see. It's down somewhere. I gotta go down. A one-way trip down, go. Commander Shepard. You make it sound so final, Dr. Tassoni. Let's go. Not like we couldn't climb up. We could help each other climb up if we needed to. Damn oh. it! I'm so sorry. I thought you were Geth, or one of those Baron. Who are you, and what are you doing in here? It's my own fault. Everyone else was running, and I stayed to back up data. Next thing I knew, the Geth ship latched on, and the power went out. I was trapped. I, I tried to get out, but the way was blocked. I'll fight my way through the Geth soon enough. It's not the Geth. It's the energy field they put up. They don't want anyone else getting access to the... I'm here for the Geth. If you know something, tell me. I don't know for certain, but I'm guessing they're here for the Thorian. The Thorian? What is that exactly? Yeah. It's an indigenous life form. Exogeny was studying it. I need more information. I need to know why the Geth are after this Thorian. I... I might be able to, but not with those Geth crawling around everywhere. Look, we need to get out of here, past that field. Well, at least you're not telling me I need to talk to Fight Anne. You seem to have your mind intact. Any suggestions? No, not exactly. But I think the Geth ship is powering it. I've noticed the Geth laying power cables everywhere. You could follow those cables, but there's Geth all over the place. Why do you think the Geth would be interested in the Thorian? It's just a plant. I don't know why the Geth would care. Exogeny was studying it, but... I don't think they found anything special. Tell me what you know about the Thorian. I really don't know that much about it. I think it's some kind of plant being. I know it's very old. Thousands of years even. Tell me about yourself. I'm just a research assistant for Exogeny. I came here with my mother. I don't even know if she made it out alive. She's with some others from the colony. She's safe for now. She's alive? Oh, thank God. I thought I was the only one left. Mm. Please, Commander, just get that field down so I can see my mother again. Okay. I think that's all the questions I have. You stay put. I'll go open some doors. Oh, here, take my ID. This should get you past any locked doors. Good luck with that field. Uh-oh. Let's take You've them out. got company.
out, people. Liara, I need you to do something here. Throw. Talk about being back in the corner. Wow. Okay. Let's go and poor Tally. I know she's not dead. Come on. Wake up. Those Varen bites really must be uh, quite severe. Just take some Metagel. You'll be fine. It's just a scratch. All right, let's keep moving. Stupid machine. Uh oh, access encrypted files. I don't want to review protocol. I am unable to comply. Please contact your supervisor. Damn it! Tell me what I want or I'll blast your virtual ass into actual dust! Please contact your supervisor for a level 4 security exemption or make an appointment with... Stupid machine! If there is nothing else, please step aside. There is a queue forming behind you for the use of this console. All right, people. All right, Liara, throw him to keep him off balance. Tally, sabotage him so he can't shoot us. And I'm just going to wait to see how powerful... No, I'm going to throw him, too. Oh! Oh! He's biotic. All right, we stunned him, though. All right, Tally. Time for you to dampen him. Liara, take off his shields. I'm gonna get Singularity going. And he's down. That's the last of them. Exogeny Corporation reminds all staff that the discharging of weapons while on company property is strictly forbidden. Well, Welcome it's a bit back, late research now. assistant Elizabeth Bainham. What can I do for you? Uh, how do you know I'm Lisbon? Your access card identifies you as Elizabeth Bainham. Is there something you require, Dr. Bainham? What information was the last user attempting to access? Fetching data. The previous user was attempting to access details on the study of subject species 37, the Thorian. 37? What did you tell him? I was unable to provide the previous user with any relevant data. Aside from lacking proper access, there has been no new data available on Species 37. All sensors monitoring the observation post at Zoo's Hope have been inactive for several cycles. What does Zoo's Hope have to do with the Thorian? Species 37 is located within the substructure of the Zoo's Hope outpost. Tell me everything you know about the Thorian. The Thorian is a simple plant life form that exhibits a sentient behavior uncommon with other flora. Through dispersion and the eventual inhalation of spores, it can affect and control other organisms, including humans. Uh -oh. The Zoo's Hope Control Group has yielded interesting results. Before sensors went offline, almost 85% of all test subjects were infected. Exogeny knew all along what would happen to those people. It was deemed necessary to assess the true potential of Species 37. That explains their strange behavior. Your pilot should be warned. Joker. Come in, Joker. Damn it. That field's blocking us. We must find a way around the field. We must get back to Zoo's Hope. VI, tell me about the field surrounding the facility. I have limited data on the Geth. They have effectively blocked all sensors within the facility. I have detected unusual power fluctuations, but am unable to determine the source. 
What do you know about the Geth? I have no specifics on the Geth as they relate to this facility. All sensors have been purposely decommissioned since their arrival. That's convenient. I want to know about Exogeny Corporation. Exogeny Corporation is at the forefront of human expansion in the new galactic economy, funding colonial development and securing resource rights to ensure our progress as a species. Further inquiries regarding company policy may be directed to consumer information services during regular business hours. Who's in charge here? Who organized the research? All decisions about local resource analysis and acquisition are made by on-site management deferring to the board of directors only when seasonal quotas are missed or exceeded. Individual employee records are confidential. Hmm. Tell me about the Thorium. Species 37 was discovered several weeks ago when a small team was infected with spores while examining ruins near the Zoo's Hope outpost. The outpost was quarantined immediately and study of the infection began. Within 21 days, 58% of colonists exhibited altered behavior. Within 28 days, 85%. Hmm. What's the size of this thing? The Thorian appears to be a diffused creature. Its cognitive abilities are centered in large nerve bundles, but it receives data from kilometers of meandering tendrils. We have discovered bundles approximately one meter in diameter, but these seem insufficient to coordinate the massive sensory potential it possesses. It may simply process such stimulation slowly, or perhaps there is a nerve cluster of a greater magnitude we have not yet encountered. Is it intelligent? Can I reason with it? The Thorian does not exhibit the focused behavior of a predator. The release of spores is an act of survival, not aggression. It does trigger advanced behaviors in the humans it enslaves, but we have yet to discover whether it recognizes or is capable of recognizing humans as more than tools. It is sufficiently alien as to defy classification at this time. Do you know how the creature controls its slaves? The will subversion manifests as intense pain if directives are ignored. Uh -oh. The effect is severe enough that subjects are soon conditioned against even minor thoughts of rebellion. Observation suggests the Thorian views its thralls in a utilitarian way. Care is apparently taken to avoid injuring them, much as a craftsman avoids damaging his tools. As long as no action is taken against the creature's objectives, the subjects are free to pantomime a normal existence until specifically tasked with something. Oh boy. Oh, that's interesting. Where's the center of this thing? The Thorian is present as a weave of tendrils across much of the lower surface of Pharos. Observation of enslaved subjects suggests there may be key clusters that are tended by thralls. Unfortunately, direct observation of species 37 is limited or non-existent. Please access my personal files. Elizabeth Bainham, research assistant, biomedical division, security level four exemption. You are currently under probation due to disagreements with management over established company policy. These sanctions may be lifted if your next evaluation is more agreeable. What triggered the probation? You were marked as combative about the operations of the Zoo's Hope project, specifically regarding the handling of the infected colonists. As a result, you were tasked with monitoring the safety of the colonists for the duration of the observation. All right, that looks like it. That's enough for now. Going to standby mode. Okay, well. We will continue in our next episode with more exploration here of Exogeny Headquarters and finding a way to take down the energy field. Alright, this is Hill, and I'm out. <laughs>